Hello, Fer. Hello. How are you? I'm fine. I'm happy to start my English class today. Hey. <laughs> <Dyer>. <laughs> hey, so you have bought things in Alibaba, right? Oh, in Alibaba. Yes. Yeah, you said yes, Alibaba.com. No, uh, I I bought in AliExpress. Is is this it is it, almost the same, but just like that, aliexpress.com. Yes. Mm. So you trust them? Yes, I bought a lot of things in that platform. Um, for, for since 2017. Since 2017? Yes. Since. Okay. What is SBC? Ah, you have to change the currency in, in the top menu. You can change the, the currency to USD. I have a top menu. Let me check. SVC, and what is SVC? I don't know where that currency, where it, where is. SVC, let me check. Weird, right? Oh. <laughs> Salvadorian Colonia? <laughs> what? Really? Yes. Yeah, I, I think I found it actually. Yeah, the... Any, anything, anything, do you think uh, car parts will be trustful? Trust, you can mm. trust it? It's, it's, it's almost. It, like a uh, eBay because you have to to read the feedback you have to be, to, to watch the reputation of the store you have to you have to check all of this because for example if it's a new seller you you can find uh, any any suggests or comments about that you have to to be careful that that's that is that's it because uh, in my case i i try to to be sure with my white trusting store that I, I usually bought. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, in my case, I the, the, the products always always uh, have have come had came to, have to come the, have come to this country. Wait, products have always products have always come. Yeah, that's not. Yeah, products have always come in good conditions. Yes, but yeah. uh, I I don't I don't pay to to a special shipping. I pay for the, the for example in my case uh, AliExpress standard shipping is you you can wait a, a month but the products always can come in good conditions. Okay, <sighs> and if they are defective, have you ever had to return something? Mm, once. Oh. Uh, I bought I bought a, a a smartphone case, and the 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 warranty said uh, you have to wait only three months, and they never the the, the, the case never the case has never never come. So I have to to pay to pay their, their phone, and they they did it. they did their phone. They refunded you. Okay. Wow, 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 wow. But in that case, you have to, to open a dispute. Yeah, I guess it's a, another headache. A different kind of headache. <laughs> it's like the meme when the, the, the stores ask you for the for for a photo or, or a, how do you say, comprobante? A proof of purchase? Yes, of the, of the purchase and hey, they, they take a picture only for of the empty hand. <laughs> oh, the one we had a video we saw in the class. Man, I think I'm gonna have to do this. But man, shipping is like 76. So the item worth 109. I'm gonna pay $77 on shipping. Well, 
if the product is is very expensive, uh, you have to pay for a uh, as uh, for example UPS or FedEx maybe is cheaper. No, uh, it's expensive, but you it, for for the price maybe it's worth it. <laughs> Hopefully, it's worth it. Yeah. Well, that's oh wait, it's just from China to El Salvador. <laughs> That's yes. Chinese. Wow. What are you looking for? A carburetor. Ah. <laughs> oh, yes. This is going to be a little bit expensive, but anyways, it is what it is. I don't know. Let's see how it goes. So how was your weekend? Uh, fine. I... I did the, the usually I did every weekend, play soccer, watch some uh, soccer matches. Wait, uh, went what, to the happened, market. what happened to you on Friday? Ah, I, I had a family commitment. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, Jarvin is like, come on. Well, Friday. I, I usually don't skip. Every don't Friday. Skip class. Yeah, every Friday. Hmm. Erika too is the second Friday she misses. <laughs> what happened to you, Mrs. Beatriz? Mrs. Lopez, I'm sorry. Yes, hello teacher. Uh, usually my Fridays are the the most busy. Busy? Yes, the most busy days. And that's the reason I don't I didn't have the energy to <laughs> to join to the class. Sorry. Actually, we just we just made a mistake. My Fridays are the busiest. Busiest, busiest. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah we, <laughs> at most two one other kind of um, yeah, comparatives or superlatives, actually. Yes. Okay, okay, but I'm glad to have you back, guys. Thank you for joining us tonight. What? Cortez, good evening. It's still working right now. I hope. To be able to connect at least part of the class. Who's Cortez? Cortez has a big plumbery trouble. Okay, guys, let's do the attendance so we can start tonight's class. Um, <clears throat> you remember the last topic we talked about? Just try to remember while I do the attendance, okay? Because we're going to start doing some activity, a dynamic to remember last topic, in case you were not here. Today is Monday the 21st, and today is our 20th class. Today is our 20th class, and we will be only missing uh, five more days. I'm not sure if we will have class this coming Friday, because I requested a permission uh, to miss uh, Friday. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna finish, most likely we will finish the model on Tuesday, Tuesday, that's March 1st, right? Yeah, it's March 1st, Tuesday, March 1st. But I'll, I'll let you know tomorrow, I'll, I'll ask in a minute. Okay, let's do the attendance. Um, Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Mm -hmm. Not here tonight. Andres Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Present. Welcome. Blanca Stephanie Navarro Flores. Dora Elizabeth Flores Mendez. Hmm. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Present. Okay. Erika Beatriz Lopez Morales. Present. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present, teacher. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Francisco Amadeo Villacorta Chavez. Present. Good. Fredis Vladimir Cortez López. Here tonight yet. Glenda Laura Celada Renderos. Present. Awesome. Amos Alfredo García Granadino. Present. Yes, thank you, Laura. Where's Amos? Not here, right? Josué Alberto Salas Benítez. Present teacher. Thank you. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. Luis Ernesto.
esto. Turn on your camera, please. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. I, think, I thought I saw Sandra yes. somewhere. Oh, yeah. there she is. <laughs> Thank you. Estefanía Carolina Reyes Sánchez. Present. Thank you. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Jessica Yanari Cortés Díaz. I'm here. Thank you. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Thank you. Roberto Luis Umaño Orellana. Zuleima Ivón Moreno de Hernández. Present. Irene Susena Cuellar Albanés. Present. Jarvin Isaac Guevara Miranda. Present. And Thelma Clotilde Peña Martinez. Present. Okay, guys. So, hmm. let me start with Thelma. So, this is a dynamic, and you're going to do it with your classmates. Um, let's remember really quick. Um, Thelma. So, I'm going to give... I'm going to uh, tell me, tell me, teacher. OK, I'm going to give you a tense, a sentence. I'm sorry. I'm going to give you a sentence. And then your job will be to make it on the grammar topic that we're talking about, which is tag questions. OK, we were talking about tag questions on the previous class. So if I tell you. OK, if I tell you do gymnastics. If I tell you, do gymnastics. Mm -hmm. Try to use it. Okay, how will you do the positive statement or negative if you want? In a tag question. Uh, it's negative. I do gymnastic. Mm -hmm. need, need help? Uh, maybe the doctor recommends you Hmm. Don't I? To do gymnastics? No, no, no. Oh. Listen. Uh huh. Do I? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's not a question. Remember, a positive or negative sentence, and then to make it a tag question, you just add the short tag question. Erika, your hand is raised. Go ahead. I, I will try. And uh, did you do gymnastic, didn't you? Almost, close. Oh, Elma? Okay. Want to give it a try? No, okay. So remember, you do an affirmation if it is a positive, right? So you say, uh, Erika, you do gymnastics, don't you? Didn't you? Oh. Don't you? Okay. Um, you don't do gymnastics, do you? So it's the, op the opposite. Again, positive. Erika, you do gymnastics, don't you? The question is a negative. Erika, you don't do gymnastics, do you? Yeah, same thing. Okay, let's go for another one. <sighs> Feel awful. Edwin, Alex, no, Edwin was not in the class, I think, right? On Friday. Were you in the class on Friday? Of course, I was in the class. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Sorry. Short term no memory. Short term memory. Uh -huh. So, <laughs> okay. go ahead. Awful. What was the. Uh, awful. Feel awful. Awful. Feel awful. Uh, do you feel awful yesterday? Uh, come on. It's not a question. It's not a okay. question. Okay. Um, I feel awful yesterday. Hmm. Uh, hmm. Oh my God. Wait. Volunteer, volunteer. Someone who was on Friday. Don't you? Don't you? Good, Doris, try it. Say the sentence. Uh, you, you, you feel awful. You feel awful. 
Mm-hmm. You don't feel well? No, no, no. It, it, you don't feel well? You don't feel Do. awful? Do you? Do you? Yeah. Excellent. Ahí está. Okay, very good. There it is. So, yeah. So let's say this is like somebody, hold on. You feel awful, don't you? Okay, and uh, William said, you don't feel awful. Do you? Okay, now what's feeling awful? Is it feeling ugly? No. Uh, Let's put some context in this question. We were walking with Jocelyn on the street and we found um, a homeless guy. We found a homeless person and I didn't give him money. I didn't give him money. So Jocelyn tells me, you feel awful, don't you? You got it? Did you get it? The perfect example, okay, you feel awful, don't you? Okay, so then I turned back and I gave him $5, okay? Then I came back with a smile and Jocelyn said, you don't feel awful, do you? Eh, I'm okay. You see, feeling awful is like, uh, feel awkward, you know, in a bad situation. Okay. Um, now let's clarify this. Jocelyn. Tell me. Okay. Tell me. Yeah, there you go. Cooking vegetables. You uh, get you get home. Fun. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You get home and you find your mom cooking vegetables. Mm -hmm. Are you cooking vegetable? Aren't you? Uh huh. Now it's not a question, right? So make an affirmation and then the question. You are cooking. Uh huh. You are cooking vegetable, aren't you? Perfect. Do you? No, no, no. You're fine. You're fine. Remember okay. the auxiliary. Good job. Yeah. Present continuous. Hey, you're cooking. You're cooking vegetables, aren't you? Or you hate vegetables. How will you do it if you hate vegetables? Give me the expression. Remember this. This is this. You must show expression expressions. You know when you use this. So Jocelyn, you hate vegetables. Make it negative and then positive question. Uh, you are cooking vegetable. Negative. Uh, negative. Okay. Come on, show me some. You are now cooking. acting. Some acting, Jocelyn. I want to see you acting like this. Oh, okay. Okay. Perfect. I will try. You are now cooking vegetables. Are you? Are you? <laughs> are you? Come on, you're like, oh, yeah, sorry, sorry. You're not cooking vegetables. You are right? now cooking vegetables. Are you? <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Okay. You got the idea, guys. You get the idea? One more. Uh, let's see, Fernando, you're walking with Erica on the street. Remember, it's an affirmation, and then you make the little question. Okay. Uh, Erika, that's the car you like. Uh, isn't you? Oh, close, close. Try it again. The guy. Ah. Oh, that. That. that that's the guy you like. Uh, isn't... Isn't he? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you could say isn't he, but since you're using that, it ah, would be isn't, isn't, isn't it? it? Isn't it? Isn't it? You got okay. it. Okay. Hey, that's the guy you like, isn't it? Okay. You got it? Negative. That isn't the guy you like, is it? Is it? Because mm -hmm. he's fat, and Eddie guy's like, <laughs> <laughs> that isn't like you like is it you got it okay so give an example if you do you have any questions questions 
Irene, hold on. I have a question and I have a real question for um, Irene. Hold on. I always forget this verb. You, you dyed your hair, didn't you? You dyed your hair, didn't you? Yes. I? I died, yes. I, I, did, I, I did. did, I did. I did. Yes, I did. Yes. That's a question. That's a question you may have. How do you answer these tag questions, teacher? Just like simple questions, close questions. Yes, I did. No, I didn't. Yes, I do. No, I don't. Etc. You got it? Okay. Okay. Hmm. Uh, Irwin. You have been sick, haven't you? Yes. Yes. Is uh, yes, yes, I I, have. yes, I have. Yes, I have. Yeah. Yes, I have. But, but you have gone to the doctor, haven't you? I've gone to the doctor. I've gone. I've gone. I've gone. I've gone. Perfect. I've gone. I've gone to the doctor. Excellent. Okay. That's what I want to hear. Just make questions to your classmates, expect an answer return the question, you can have a long conversation with just tag questions. The examples are in your WhatsApp since last Friday, in case you, you didn't come to the class. I hope you watch the class online. Okay, so let's go. Hi, good evening, guys. Oh, pra... sí. eh, hello, sorry, Irene. Francisco. Hello, Irene. Uh, Hello. I have a resolve some situation here, but I am here. Um, We're going to talk about that question. Yes. Mm, maybe. Uh, let me check. Uh, we can use to share the exercise in the page number 28. No, oh. make, make your own examples. Ooh. Okay. Uh, do you do you do exercise? Is correct? A question? No, it's not, it's not a question. It's an affirmation. Remember, you do exercise, don't you? Uh, do you exercise? Uh, you do, do exercise, you, do don't you? you? Exercise? Uh, uh you, do you do? You do. You do exercise, don't you? Okay. Mm. Irene, do you do mm. exercise? <laughs> it's not a question. 
You do exercise, don't you? Okay, uh, let's remove the do. You you exercise, do. don't you? You exercise, don't you? Don't you? Okay, don't. recorda. Si es una afirmación en positivo, o sea, una afirmación es positiva, ¿no? Eh, decís, tú te ejercitas, ¿verdad? ¿Sí? Entonces, tú no te ejercitas, ¿verdad? Eso es lo que estás preguntando. Ese verdad, para decir ese verdad o, o no, ¿sí? Vas a ocupar el auxiliar. Si esa es la oración en positivo, vas a hacer la preguntita corta usando el auxiliar del tiempo que estás ocupando, ya sea en positivo o en negativo. So, oye, um, Irene, you exercise, sería negativa la pregunta corta. Don't you? Uh -huh. Si es negativa la, la afirmación que estás haciendo, Irene, you don't exercise. Do you? ¿Ya? Yeah? Ok. Uh -huh. Ok. Dale. I try, I try, I try. Irene, do you exercise? Don't you? No. Mm -hmm. Olvídate Olvidado. de poner el do al principio como que si fuese una pregunta. Yes, you, Irene. You exercise? No. Cabal. Irene, you exercise. Don't mm -hmm. you? Don't you? Ahí está. Ok. <laughs> Hey, keep it up, guys. Give more examples so you understand the topic, okay? Okay. We just like to... Yes. Yes. I have okay. to work after the class to, to finish the, the platform. Today? Yes, today. Okay. Come on, guys, make more examples. You can do it. Okay, Fernando, so you will be a study after the class. What are you? Is wooden or won't you? Won't you? I think. Won't you? Okay. Yes, I will. I don't know if I am wrong, but platform when you are, we are using the, how do you say, comilla? <laughs> when you use uh, quotations. Quotations. Uh, quotations. It's okay. very difficult because you, I don't know what is the, the correct for, for that example. I try to copy the, the, the quote on the on the on the text of the platform okay another example uh, uh, Edwin, is Edwin, is Edwin, uh? do you play tennis on Sunday I'm sorry do you play tennis Oh, okay. <laughs> now, let's not make it a question. Forget about the auxiliary okay. on the okay. first statement. It's got to be positive or negative. Okay. You play tennis on Sundays? Hey, it's an affirmation. Yes. You play tennis on Sundays? Don't you? Don't you? Do it again, Irene. Do it again. You play play you 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 play tennis on Sunday. Okay. Ahí, va. Ahí está la entonación, no va hacia arriba la entonación. Es una afirmación, como cuando cuando sabes que un cliente arruinó la batería y te quiere hacer la camita. Anyway. Esa esa cara, esa esa okay. ese tono quiero ir. Vamos a. Okay. Do again. You you play tennis on Sunday, don't you? Todavía es una pregunta. You play tennis. You play tennis on Sunday, don't you? Ahí está. <laughs> ok. 
busqué y... Eh, Uh, Erwin, you have your your own business. Your own business. Uh, haven't you? Uh, don't, don't you? you? Don't you? Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Yes, okay. I do. Yes, I do. Uh, Jarvin is never on time in class. Is he? Isn't he? Isn't he? Uh -huh. Jarvin he said is, Jarvin never, is on never on time on, on class. class. <laughs> on class. Isn't he? Isn't he? Uh -huh. Oh, wait, wait. He's saying is never, think... right? Is never. Yes. So that, that makes yes. the sentence negative. Oh. oh uh -huh. okay. So? Okay. Jarvin. Um... Jarvin is never on time on class. Is he? Is he? Is he? Okay. Right, because you said never, so that, that makes the sentence negative. Very good. Keep it up. Negative. Okay. Yeah. Try to use past, future models. If you have any questions, let me know. Okay, why are you so quiet? We, we have uh, some samples, just uh, no picture. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Bless you. Thank you. You didn't hear that, right? No. Okay. I have I have a problem with a question in, pla in platform teacher. The question said. Charles would, will help us, and I, I answer, doesn't he? What's wrong? The microphone. Oh my God, my microphone was off, I'm sorry. Okay, okay. Uh, yeah, can you make the question again? The yeah, question said, Charles, Charles will help us? And I answer, doesn't he? It's just that I'm, I'm, I'm not getting your question. Okay, I will. I will. Do it again, mm -hmm. do it again. It said, Charles will, Help us. Oh, Charles Char will help us. Who who will help us? Uh -huh. Don't he? Charles. Doesn't he? Mm -hmm. um, um, one, one he. One, one he, one he, I'm sorry, yes. Okay. Yeah, you said will, so yes, it's one, one he. Okay. Let me check. Okay, now it's correct. Yeah, it's the same. Julio will help us, wouldn't he? That's right. 
The exam was complicated or is it? Really? Mm. Oh, I'm sorry, you're <laughs> the example. Okay. The, the, the exam was complicated, wasn't it? For example, if I said she was dancing today, wasn't she? Perfect. You got the idea. Okay. Okay, try to use other tenses. Uh, Suleyma, give me an example. He's not going to say that, is he? He's not going to say that, is he? Uh-huh. Mm. Yeah. Hey, that's that's future. He's not going to say that, right? He's not going to say that, is he? Uh huh. That's a good example. Yeah, because you have to use the auxiliary. That's right. Okay. Next. Come on, guys. Keep it up. Make a lot of examples so you understand. Try to use models. They. You got it. Mm hmm. Do you find any? You look old. This exercise, yes. But no, maybe. Mm -hmm. The car isn't in the garage. The car isn't in the garage. Yes. Is it? Is it? Okay. You are young. You are Williams. Um, aren't you? I don't know. You are John. You are Williams. You are John. You are John, aren't you? Aren't you? Okay. Mm -hmm. Cars, I don't know what to say. Populs, a cars, populs the environment. Contaminar. Cars. Pollute. Pollution. Cars pollute the environment. Cars pollute the environment. Pollute. Pollute. Mm. Is a. Uh... Does. No. Do. Don't do... they? Don't they? Okay. Don't they? The trip is very expensive. Isn't it? Vamos a ver. She went to the library yesterday. Wait, she Did went you? to the liver? Library. Yes. Yesterday. Oh, to the library. She went to the library. She went to the library yesterday. Did she? Didn't she? Didn't she? Oh, yeah. Didn't she? Mm -hmm. Okay, teacher. Okay. And, and when I used to went at the very pass, and that question is, el auxiliar do en pass. It depends if you have an action. If it ah. is an action, yes. Okay. He didn't recognize me. Did she? Did she? He didn't recognize me. Yeah. Did she? Did, Did she? Because, yeah, the question is in 
I mean, the statement is in negative. Negative, uh-huh. Did he say it? He didn't recognize me, did he? Did he? Did he? Mm -hmm. Okay. I look, I looking at more examples. I'm looking for more I examples. Look, I'm looking mm -hmm. for more examples. Excellent. For example, did you, uh, are, are you okay? Are you? That's a question and that's the problem. Everybody's getting confused. You're mm -hmm. not making a question. You're making an affirmation, ah, okay. negative or positive. So do it again. You are okay. For example, are aren't you? you? Are you? Aren't you? I'm sorry. Yeah. You're yeah. okay. Aren't you? You're okay. Aren't you? Like that. You're okay. Aren't you? When I was just mm -hmm. Martí, otro en la casa, I <laughs> you're okay, right? Okay. You can say right. <laughs> Saying right is like very natural. Like, you're okay, aren't you? Like <laughs> and your brother's like, yeah, yeah I'm okay. <laughs> I'm okay. <laughs> <laughs> that happened to me. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, right here. Okay, it is, it is not about a question, teacher. No, it's an affirmation. Affirmation, yeah, in positive or negative. Positive or negative, yeah, because you do negative affirmations, you know, like. Okay, uh, and you have to change the answer. Yeah, you aren't okay, are you? Are you? Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Got you. Got you. I have other, other SSR. She didn't swim yesterday. Mm -hmm. She didn't. She didn't swim yesterday. Did she? You got it. What is she? <laughs> Did she? <laughs> Did you? Uh -huh. um, I just said that you you don't like your job. So if you would like a new job. <laughs> I will get it. If it's more money, I will do it. Even okay. I don't like it. Like money. <laughs> okay. You can speak two languages. Can you? Mm. No, I can't. Mm, I can or try it. <laughs> okay. Um, you could do you could do it for me, couldn't you? I just my I homework, could. my platform, please. Yes, I do. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. okay. No. Um, Let's do it. Okay, you should go now, shouldn't you? That is uh, just a. I, I shouldn't. Uh, it's not remember yes, remember that me. that um we're doing affirmations whether those are mm -hmm. negative or positive it's gonna yeah. be an affirmation so i don't know with should mm, you should go out shouldn't you yeah mm -hmm. yeah but uh, yeah your friend is very depressed you know <laughs> eating ice cream in front of the TV because her boyfriend <laughs> broke up with her. So you're like, you should, you should go out, shouldn't you? Get ready. We're going out. We're going out. Yeah, I got okay. you. Okay. Okay. Uh, next one. We must be patient. Must. Must. How do you pronounce? This teacher must mustn't, mustn't, mustn't we? Mustn't we? Okay. Mustn't that we. sounds weird. Yes. We must be patient. Don't you think? Don't you think? <laughs> Don't you think? No crees? Don't you think? Mm -hmm. yeah. That sounds us. that sounds more natural. Mustn't mm -hmm. we? Mustn't we? I mean, yes. you can do it. You can do it. Grammatically, it's okay. It sounds not natural. I don't know. It sounds weird. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We could go to the movies, couldn't we? Couldn't we? Yes. Keep going. Keep going. 
Okay. This Friday. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, because we're going to have free. Oh, oh but I Thank can't. You, teacher. <laughs> yeah, no, I couldn't because I, I have something to do. You're so mean. Sure. Hey. Do we go to the party on Friday? No, I have. Are you? Are you? No. Will you? Will, will, you, will, will I? You, no, I won't. No, I won't. <laughs> I, I have a retirement, let's say, a three days thing at church, you know, when we're leaving on Friday and coming back on Sundays. Oh, that's so nice. Time. What would you do with the call center job? Oh, I asked for uh, permission for Saturday. I'm not working on Saturday mornings. Oh, okay. They gave me vacation. Aloha. Nice. Yeah. Aloha. Mm -hmm. uh, well, it's actually paid. They're going to pay me the day, so that's okay. I have. Oh, discretionary yeah. day. Aha, uh -huh, discretionary. Thank oh. you. Yes, that's the word. Yeah. Let's see how it goes. Can you repeat that? Discretionary. 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 Yeah, discretionary. What is the meaning? Uh, that I'm living with discretion. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, uh, I'm living things. I'm, I'm living the discretion. Uh, upon the discretion of my, my employer, I'm taking one day off. And it's up to the discretion of my employer if he, they pay me or not. Oh, and they say yes. I mean, usually I have one discretionary day every six months, I think, or every three months. I can't remember. It's a good. Mm -hmm. It's a benefit. It's a benefit. Okay. I don't even need to give a reason, you know. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Anderson, thank you. Okay, let's keep it up. Let's go back. Thank you. Okay. Let's see if anybody has okay. any questions with this topic. It's, it's interesting, but you guys are getting confused somehow. Okay, just, a, well, let's wait for the others. Okay, um, let's make it real with really quick here. It's going to be a little bit difficult for me to. There it is. Okay. So let's see if I do this and this and that. Okay, everybody come together right now. Okay, you can turn on your microphone. We often watch TV in the evening. What is the tag question? Don't you? Don't we? Uh-huh. Don't we? What do you think, guys? We often watch TV in the evening. So I'm not just going to ask you to answer the question. I mean, add the tag question, but tell me why. Why do you think it's don't? And why do you think it's we? And... The the is a positive. Okay, it's positive. Uh huh. And it's an action. Watch. Watch is an action. Very good. Mm -hmm. And no, it's it's no bird to be. It's not bird to be. That's right. It's a, it's an action. Watch. And what is the subject? Third person from the plural. Oh come on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's we. Don't we? Excellent. Don't we? Very good. Next. You have cleaned my bike. Okay, everybody, what's the grammar tense? What's the grammar tense in this? Present, present perfect. perfect. Yes, present, present oh, perfect. Present. So? Sorry. Haven't, haven't you? Haven't you? Haven't you? 
Haven't you? Yeah, I agree with you. Haven't you? So it is a positive statement. Y les recuerdo, hacemos, hacemos afirmaciones, ya sean afirmaciones negativas o positivas. Estás afirmando, no estás haciendo una pregunta, ¿ok? <laughs> ¿Y de dónde? Imagínate. Ok, ok. So, it's just, estoy siguiendo un tipo en YouTube que um, hace ejercicio y no sé de dónde. Yo creo que es iraní, pero habla bien chistoso. Bull, Bull Academy se llama algo así. Ok. Uh, That's funny. No, no, no. Bull Academy. Okay, you have cleaned my bike, haven't you? Okay. Next. Mary didn't do her homework last Monday. Doesn't she? Did she? Did she? Did she? Excellent. Did she? Did she? This is past. And okay. Mary, Mary is she. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did she? Did she? Negative question. Well, negative sentence. Sentence. Negative sentence. Mary didn't do her homework last Monday. Did she? Mm -hmm. Okay. Peter played volleyball yesterday. Didn't he? Yeah. Yeah. Didn't he? Totally didn't he because the verb mm -hmm. is in past. Played. Peter played okay. volleyball. Okay. Peter played the volleyball yesterday. Didn't he? Okay, I want to hear the rest. I want to hear Sandra, Irwin, Thelma. I want to hear Luis. Welcome, Luis. Glenda, come on, guys. Turn on your camera and give me the answers. Come on. Okay, next. They are going home now. Aren't they? Thank you, Fernando. Yes, aren't they? Because it is in positive. So they are going, they are going home, home now. now. Okay, aren't they? That's right, aren't they? Next, they don't like mathematics. Irene, Francisco, Alexander, do they? Yuri. Do they? Do they? Do, they? do they? Very good. They don't like mathematics. Do they? You got it. This is easy, guys. She can swim, so easy. She can swim. Can she? Can she? Can she? Can she? Yeah, yeah, this is like Chinese. Can she? <laughs> she can swim. Can she? Can she? Okay. Can she? Can she? Okay. You haven't been to America. Have you? Have you? Have you? Ooh, good. Have you? You're doing good job. Have you? It's simple. Come on. Present perfect. Auxiliary is have. We have subject you. Okay. Have you? Next, Jane, Jane goes to the ninth grade. Doesn't she? Yeah, in fact, yeah. Third Jane person. goes to the ninth grade. Doesn't she? Third person, Jane goes, okay, doesn't she? Next, mm -hmm. they had an ice cream. And they? Again? Aren't? They? Aren't? Sulema, what do no. you think? They yeah. had an ice cream. Wait, no, no. They had an ice cream. Yes, that's the answer, actually. <laughs> oh, <my. laughs> right? Sule, what do you think? They had an ice cream. Hadn't they? Hmm. Uh, yeah, it's simple past, actually. This is the main verb. They had an ice cream. Didn't, didn't they? they? Didn't they? Didn't. They had an ice cream, didn't they? Uh, listen, guys. This is very important. Tu intonación es muy importante. O sea, ahorita pretender es bien natural. Se comieron un helado, ¿no? Eso es lo que estás preguntando. Se comieron un helado, ¿no? Yeah. Think about it. The way you will do it in Spanish is the same thing in English. You can play chess. Jose Alberto, you can play chess. Can you? Can you? In negative, right. Can you? Okay. You can play chess. Can you? Okay. You will be there. Irene, mm. you, will, you will be there. You will Are be you? there. Hmm. Okay. So, Irene, is Are this in positive or negative? You will be there. Adding you. Positive. It's positive. Okay. It's a positive statement. You will be there. What is the grammar sentence? Is it past? Future. Future will with will. 
So since it is in positive, I have to make the tag question in negative. Okay. Okay, so. One, no. Excellent, yes, One. yes. Don't doubt, Irene, don't doubt. Okay. Want? Want you. Want you. Want okay. you? Okay, listen. You will be there. You will be there. Want you? Want you. Okay. Yeah. Even contracting sounds better. You'll be there, won't you? You'll. You'll be there, won't you? Okay. He's a student. Suleyma, again. He's a student. Isn't he? Excellent. Isn't he? I'm going to move faster. Luis, she has already graduated. Excuse me. Again? Didn't she? Oh, let's think. Mm -hmm. Auxiliary for the third person. Of she has present already perfect. graduated. Present perfect has graduated. Okay. Uh huh. Hasn't she? Hasn't she? That's right. So she hasn't. He. She has already graduated. Hasn't she? Hasn't she? Hasn't she? She has already graduated, hasn't she? Hasn't she? Man, we're speaking Chinese. She was angry at you, Estefania. She was angry at you. Oh, she's driving, I think. You're driving, no, don't worry, forget it. No. I'm okay. driving. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know, be careful. Okay, uh, who, 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 who? Sandra, she was angry at you. She was angry at oh. you. Wasn't not. Yeah, 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 yeah. She wasn't. Oh, the opposite. Wasn't. She was angry at you. She wasn't. Wasn't she? Oh, sorry. Wasn't. No, she? but you're okay. Chicos, están dudando de ustedes mismos y ya se ponen las respuestas. Las la dos. Irene. Um, yeah. Sandra, ambas tenían la respuesta, pero no duden, no duden. Wasn't she? So I have. Was my she auxiliary was angry at you. subject she? Okay, wasn't she? You will like a cup of coffee. Ha <laughs> ha, Fernando. You will like a cup of coffee. Uh, wouldn't you? Wouldn't you? Simple. Hey, you. Muy, muy probablemente no vayas a escuchar esto así en americano. Si no, que solo vas a escuchar. You'd like you'd you'd like a cup of coffee. You'd like a cup of coffee. Wouldn't you? Wouldn't you? Wouldn't you? Wouldn't you? See? You'd like. Okay. English is your favorite subject. Jessica, English is your favorite subject. English is your favorite subject. Isn't it? Perfect. Isn't it? Isn't it? Sounds better. Isn't it? Good job. Two more, two more. Your friend plays the guitar. Freddy's. Your friend plays the guitar. <laughs> <laughs> I have to you use play the guitar. I have to use um, you or or he. Oh, you tell me, my friend. <laughs> your friend plays the guitar. Who is your friend? Is it first, second, or third person? How do you read third person, right? You got it. He or she. Okay, so plays the guitar. Okay. Oh, wait. Playing the guitar is an action, your right? Your plays the guitar. It's an action. So, and I'm talking about a third person. Your friend plays the guitar. Person. Your friend plays the guitar. Doesn't he? Ah, oh, come on. Yeah, you got it. Doesn't he? Okay, again. So your friend, in this case, is he or she, whatever. Your friend plays the guitar. Doesn't, third person. This is a positive sentence, so I have to use the tag question in negative. Doesn't he? Okay, Freddie, try it again. She didn't call you last night. Did she? Did she? Easy. Did she? Did she? 
Okay. Last one. You come from Tallinn. What? You come from Tallinn. Don't, don't you? Don't you forget about me. Yep. I'll be. Hmm. Okay. Simple as that. Focus on the grammar tense, the auxiliary. Is this first, second, or third person if it is present? Okay. And then you use the auxiliary, whether it is positive or negative, to make the tag question. Make more exercises. We are late for, no, it's 9.02. We're fine on time. Let's do the attendance really quick. Second time. And then we're going to hit the second topic of this class. Ta -ta -ta -ta. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Thank you. Andres Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Present. Blanca Stephanie Navarro Flores. Hmm. Dora Elizabeth Flores Mendez. Present. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Present. Erika Beatriz López Morales. Present. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Francisco Amadeo Villacorta Chávez. Present. Fredis Vladimir Cortés López. Ok. Glenda Laura Celada Renderos. Present. Eimos Alfredo García Granadino. Ok. José Alberto Salas Benítez. Present. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Present teacher. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. And. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Estefanía Carolina Reyes Sánchez. Present. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Jessica Yanari Cortés Díaz. I'm here. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Roberto Luis Umaño Arellana. Zuleima Ivonne Moreno Hernández. Present. Irene Susana Cuellar Albanés. Present. Jarvin Isaac Guevara Miranda. Present. And Thelma Clotilde Peña Martínez. Elma. Está Elma here. Where's Elma? Oh my God, we lost her. I was about to do something for her. Our next topic. Hmm. Each morning I get up and I'm little. Hold on. Uh... I can't remember the tone of this song. I'm <laughs> sorry, I wanted to do it, but I can't. Every day I try and I try, but everybody wants to put me down. They say I'm going crazy. They say I got a lot of water in my brain. I got nobody left to believe in. Okay. They made all your songs. <laughs> somebody, somebody, can anybody find me? Somebody to love. <laughs> no, don't cry, teacher. Find <laughs> me somebody to love. Yeah, somebody, anybody, anywhere, oh. everywhere. Okay. Somewhere. Does that sound familiar? Yeah? How do you call these things? Okay, let me make think it better. How do you replace anybody with a subject pronoun? Anybody's in my baby? The Rolling Stones. Has anybody seen my baby? No? 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 Okay. Nope. She's beautiful. Okay. Uh huh. How do you replace anybody with a subject? Is it he, she, or it, or what? They, we? They? Anybody? Uh, any. Any. It's like a it. No. 
<laughs> oh, come on, Alexander. The same Anybody. with Barry. She Anybody. someone. She. She or he. She or he. That's it. What about somebody somewhere? Rolls Stewart. Somebody somewhere. Passion. I think that's the name of the song. Passion. Everybody needs passion. Man, I'm too old. I'm, I will stop singing. I'm sorry. Okay. Uh huh. Everybody wants to rule the world. If you don't know what song that is, don't talk to me anymore. I'm here when I try to activate the microphone. Something else pop out. Freddy's. Okay, I got you. Um, okay, where's Thelma? I think she got disconnected. So um, let's talk about this indefinite pronouns. Okay, indefinite pronouns. Why are they indefinite? Because you don't know if it's he or she or it. Okay. It's dangerous. You just don't know. How can you determine if something like an indefinite pronoun is a he or a she? It all depends on the context. I hope you're paying attention. Okay. Just pay attention. Don't write. Okay. Because I will send you this presentation later. This is not mine, it's something that I found on the internet. And I always use it to define these terms in better way. So help me, Erika. You read? Would you please read for us? Okay, indefinite pronouns. In general, they are used when we don't want to say exactly who, what, or, or where. For example, somebody broke the window I went somewhere nice at the weekend. Somebody broke the window. Okay, who broke the window, William? Somebody. Who knows? <laughs> Nobody knows. Okay. Somebody, Alexander, somebody I went knows. somewhere nice at the weekend. Where did I go? No somewhere. <laughs> no idea. <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> Remember last <that's... laughs> Yeah. Okay, so this indefinite pronouns correspond to Jocelyn. These indefinite pronouns correspond to somebody, anybody, nobody, people. People. Mm -hmm. Okay. Something, anything, and nothing. Thing. Somewhere, anywhere, nowhere, places. Easy as that. Okay. Okay. And I will do anything for love. Oh, I will do anything for love. Who sings that song? Come on. No idea. Really? What? The teacher? No. Meet love. Come on, guys. Meet love. I don't know about that. You don't, I don't know about that. Yeah, that's from the Beauty and the Beast. It's true. Meet love. Meet love. I recommend John, you. John Legend. Uh, John Legend is the one who sings La Bella Bestia with really? Ariana Grande. Yeah. Mm, yes. The latest movie, maybe. I don't know. Mm, yes. I don't know about that. Okay, somewhere. Yes, anyway. <laughs> okay, so you got the idea. Let's move on. Somebody, something, somewhere. When you use some, when you use some, Andres, continue. When, when you do somebody something somewhere, we use them in affirmative sentences. She said something, she saw somebody, she went somewhere. We use it in questions, especially something, when we offer something. Would you like something to drink? Okay, rules. These are rules, pay attention. In affirmative sentences, you can use something, somebody, or somewhere. Be careful. Affirmative sentences. Mm. Can I say, she didn't say something? Can I say, anything. she didn't? Uh -huh. She didn't say anything. Yeah. Uh, Erica, can I say, she didn't saw somebody? 
she didn't see somebody. Oh my God, she didn't see somebody. She didn't saw anybody. Oh. Don't do the, don't do what I do. I'm sorry. She didn't see anybody. She didn't see anybody. She didn't see anybody. That will be the right way. That's right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Same thing with she went somewhere, Freddy. Can I say she didn't go somewhere? No. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. Come on. Okay. She didn't go somewhere. No, she didn't go anywhere. She didn't go anywhere. You got it. Okay. And we use it in questions, especially something when we want to offer something to someone. Would you like something to drink? I don't know. What would you like to drink? So something. Okay. Uh, something like coffee or water. What would you like to drink? Something. Okay. Questions. Oh, yeah, William, no. what? Okay, good. So we're using some plus body plus thing plus where. Keep that in mind. Any, the same thing. Anybody, anything, anywhere. Doris. Anybody, anything, anywhere. We use it in negative sentences. She didn't say anything. She didn't see anybody. She didn't, she didn't go anywhere. We use, the, we use it in the most interrogative sentences. Are you doing anything tonight? Has anybody seen her? Did they go anywhere? Excellent, thank you. Yeah, so questions. This is very simple, but it's just be careful with this part specifically. Anything is mostly negatives and questions, okay? You may not see that on a positive, okay? In a positive sentence. Mm -hmm. Can I say, I do nothing all day? I can, oh, wait, hold on, I do anything. I do anything all day. I do anything all day. No. Nope. Hmm. I do nothing, right? You have to say, I do nothing all day. Be careful with that. I do nothing all day. Okay, no questions? I'll send you this presentation in a minute. So you can print it if you want or just copy it. Okay, moving on. Nobody, nothing, nowhere. Irwin. We use them in affirmative sentences, also they transform the meaning into negative. There is a nobody in the room, nothing happened, there was nowhere to eat. We use them alone as the answer to a question, where did you go after the party? Nowhere. Excellent, just be careful, answer, answer. We use them alone as the answer, the answer to a question. Okay, where do you go after the party? Uh, nowhere. Okay, I go nowhere. I went nowhere. I went nowhere. Okay, there's nobody in the room. Nothing happened. There was nowhere to eat. Now keep that in mind. When you use them, they change the meaning of the sentence into a negative way. Nobody, nothing, nowhere. And lastly, yes, body can... Sorry, guys, this is so weird. Yeah, that, that was really, hey, stop it, Fernando. Stop playing with the internet. Come on, man. It's not funny. Man, that was really weird. I lost the connection for a few minutes. I'm sorry. But we're okay. Let me see. Yeah, we didn't lose the, the recording. Okay, just fin to finish, uh, yes, you can replace. Did you hear what I said? At the end, you can replace yes. body and one. You know, it's just like the same thing. Somebody becomes what? Someone. Anybody becomes anyone. And nobody becomes? One. No one. No one. No one. No me sale a mí. I'm sorry. Una, una chica. Come on, guys. Okay, yeah. Alicia, Alicia Keys. Come on, Alicia Keys. 
I love that song. That's a really nice song. Okay, questions. Teacher, can I say anybody comes to my party? Mm. Okay, guys, that, there's a question. How would you do it? How would you do it? Nobody. Nobody. Wait, she's okay. asking, she's making a question. Alguien quiere venir a mi fiesta? Is that what you asked, Jessica? No. Somebody. Nobody comes to my party. It's oh, an you, affirmative. It's an affirmation. Uh, okay. Yeah. No. Nobody. Nobody comes to my party. Can she can we say that? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> can I say anybody comes to my party? No. No. Why? It is a affirmative. It's not a negative. Okay. So this. how would you make it negative? Anybody didn't come to my part. It's already negative. Nobody comes to my party. Remember, nobody makes it negative, right? Nobody comes to my party. Man, nobody comes to my parties. Oh. Mm -hmm. Now, you. yeah, if you want it in past, nobody came to my party. It's still, that's negative still. Okay. Everybody came to my party. Everybody comes to my parties. Be careful with that. Everybody. Third person, everybody comes. Third person, he, she, yeah. Good. Any other question? Can anybody hear me? Can everybody yes. hear me? Can anybody hear me or can everybody hear me? Come on. I hear you. What's the right thing? Can everybody hear me? Can anybody hear me? Anybody. Anybody. Really? Can everybody oh, hear me? Think. Yes, yeah. Erika, you got it. It's both. Puede alguien escucharme? How do you say puede alguien escucharme? Can anybody? Yeah. Yeah. Listen to the girl. Can anybody hear me? Okay. Y entonces, ¿qué estoy diciendo cuando digo can everybody hear me? Todos. Can everybody hear me? Pueden todos escucharme. Okay. As simple as that. And on your book, this is on page. I lost it. Of course. Now I gave you the grammar first, and we were supposed to read something before in context. Following. I oh, know. No, we did right. Okay. Yeah, this is between page 31 and 32. Okay. Now to move on to the with the class and before we go with the reading, which is your favorite part, I know. Let's continue with open questions. How does social media marketing influence the sales of a product or service? What is the role of a blog in media marketing? We started. We started tonight's class talking about this with Fernando. If you were at the beginning of the class, you may have got this part. I was asking Fernando exactly about this and he gave me the answer. So everybody else, not Mr. Google, how does social media marketing influence the sales of a product or service? Can anybody answer the question? The key word is influence, actually. Okay. Yeah, that is the key. Uh, maybe oh, when you, you are. You are... <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, go ahead, Fred. Go ahead, Fred. Uh, when you are uh, watching uh, in, 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 any, in any social media app or something like Facebook, Instagram, uh, they feed your intention of buy, buy something. Uh, for example, uh, I, have, I, I, I am hungry. So what is the, 
if I, I watch a, a burger, I want to buy a, a burger. That I is, see. you, you need a, a, a little push up to, to buy something, influence. for example. <laughs> I got you. You need a little push. You need a little push. Yeah, you need a little push to buy something. Sometimes it's true, you know, especially with us, with men. It's so difficult for us to make a decision when we want to eat something. It's like, man, unless, unless you have a, unless you're craving, you know, what's crave, craving? Can anybody tell me? Antojo. Thank you, beautiful Spanish. Yes, like when you want to <laughs> really, really want to eat something, you know, you have an antojo, you have, you're craving for burgers, for pizza, whatever. Awesome, thank you. Okay, so you're stating that if you're craving for hamburgers, but you're not so sure, you need a push. And so social media marketing influences you to buy the product. Okay, so that's a positive influence. What about a negative influence, Stefania? What is a negative influence? Mm -hmm. Mm, the someone that that can give a bad review about us, something that you don't want to buy. Mm -hmm. That's right. Pongamos la prueba. That's right. Let's give it a try. Yeah, that those videos of YouTube or TikTok are amazing. I mean, that there's that's a clear example. Whether you want to buy something or not, you go there, you know, check the video if the guy has a video about it. What is the role of a blog in media marketing? Do you read blogs by any chance, by the way? No, Sule, you don't like blogs? No, I don't like blogs. Hmm. How can a blog, I mean, what's the role of the blog in me? media marketing, what do you think? Um, maybe explain uh, the story of a product of a store. Mm -hmm. Now, remember blogs. Can you uh, give your opinion in blogs? Yeah. Yeah, you yeah. do, right? That, that was yeah. the whole idea, right? Of before Twitter, before they share a lot of information about products, cerebral tips. Mm -hmm. You can actually open a question, right? Yeah. 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 Okay. Totally. And everybody gives you the opinion. Then you rate the best answer to your questions. Okay. So we are clear in this part. I think social media definitely impacts uh, or influences uh, the consumers, whether they want to buy or not the product. Let's see, Manuel is asking me for some pointers needed to become a, oui, a digital marketer. Mm, please correct that. A digital marketer. Uh, take turns practicing the conversation with a partner. So, Erika, help me. You are Manuel, but you have, okay. to, talk, you have to talk like this. <laughs> like one, two, three, go. What do I need to do to become a great online marketer? One more time. What do you what do I need to do to what do I need what do I need to do to become a great online marketer? Anyone can become an online marketer, but you have to create and publish content consistently. Then I think I'm great online marketer already. Just look at the posts in my blog. There are hundreds. Everybody is going to love my content. Yes, everybody is going to like your content until they get to the options menu. No one likes to navigate through a 10 option menu to get the information they need, Manuel. Oh my God. Yeah, that's boring, right? Thank you, Erika. Okay. Just one thing, be careful. Then, I'm, then I think I'm a... I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a great online marketer. I'm a great, I'm a great. Okay. Just join the sounds. I'm a great. Okay, guys, let's practice this for a few minutes and we come back to answer these questions and do some review of tag questions. How, I'm sorry, how to use um, 
indefinite pronouns. I'm sorry, we have other examples here that you need to follow through. So let's get together. What do you say if we answer the questions at once, okay? After practicing one round or two each one, you can go ahead and answer the, the exercise number three on page 31. You got it? Yes. Yes. Okay, let's go. Let me share, let me share you with your classmates. Let's go. Alexander? Who, who, who could share? <laughs> oh, I can. Thank Same. you. Oh, mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> okay. What do I need to do to become a great online marketer? Anyone can become an online marketer, but you have to create and publish content consistently. Then I think I'm a great online marketer already. Just look at the posts in my blog. There are hundreds. Everybody is going to love my content. Yes, everyone is going to like your content until they get to the options menu. No one likes to navigate through a 10 option menu to get the information they need manual. Okay. Next couple. Um, okay, January, can we try? You, you first. <laughs> okay. Okay, perfect. What do I need to do a bit? To, sorry, I will start. What okay. do I need to do to become a great online marketer? Anyone can become, become an, an online marketer, but you have to create and publish and publish content con, consistently. Then I think I am a great online marketer already. Just look at the post in my blog. There are hundreds. Go ahead. Everybody is going to love my content. Yes, everyone is going to like your content until they get they get to the options menu. No one likes to navigate through a thing of option menu to get the inf the information they need they need. Okay. Okay. What do I need to do to become a great online marketer? Anyone can become a on, an online marketer. Anyone can become an online marketer, but you have to create and publish content consistently. Yes, everyone is going to like your content. Until, until they get to the option option menu to no option menu number one I'd like to can you please uh, zoom the page well wait yes they got the option menu. No one likes to navigate through a 10 option menu to get the information they need manually. Okay. 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 Uh, William? Manuel again. Okay. 
What do I need to do to become a great online marketer? Anyone can become an online marketer, but you have to create and publish content consistently. Then I think I'm a great online marketer already. Just look at the posts in my blog. There are hundreds. Everyone, everybody, everybody is going to love my content. Yes, everyone is going to like your content until they get to the options menu. No one likes to navigate through a 10 options menu to get the information they need, Manuel. Okay, Stefania. Do okay. you want to put it again or we pass to the exercise number three? Oh, no, pass the, the exercise, I guess. Okay. <clears throat> okay, let's see. Read the conversation again and complete the sentence below. Um, number one. Anyone. Anyone. Anyone can become, yes. yes. So number one is anyone. And the number two is everybody is going to love my content. <clears throat> number three, <clears throat> Darby or William. Is everyone. Everyone is going to like your going content to. until they get to the option menu. Yeah. And the number four, William. Yo, William, are you there? <laughs> okay. <laughs> the number four is no one, I guess. Yes, no one likes to navigate. No one. Yes. Like the song. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You done? Yes. yes. Oh, okay, let's take it back. Okay. There you are. Ladies and gentlemen, I will suggest you to continue reading, try to find things that you could read. Every time I suggest this to classmates, um, to students, I remember when I was seven, eight years old, I remember somebody had, I can't remember who, but somebody had this, um, they, they used to buy newspapers from a neighbor, a neighbor, but not just any newspaper, you know, and they used to get, that's the word, they used to get the, the, the Times, the Times newspaper. A neighbor used to, used to get the, news, the Times newspaper. I believe it was the Times. But the thing is that, or the New York Post, I can't remember. But man, have you ever seen... Um, an American newspaper? Do they look like our newspapers? Hello? Uh, bigger. No. They're bigger, right, Andres? Yeah. So I, I always wondered, you know, how do they do to, to read the newspaper? Because it's 
If you unfold it, if you unfold it, it's like really, really big. So I found out years later that what they used to do is fold it and just read the part that you wanted to read. And that's why you see on the movies that they are always hanging the, the I mean, holding the, the newspaper like folded. It's big, big paper, paper pages, paper sheets. Um, so the point is that I used to read the newspaper. I mean, some parts I used to, <laughs> I try to understand because it wasn't easy. I mean, I didn't have money for books or anything. And eh. anyways, so try to find something to read all the time in English, in English, and as well in Spanish, you know, so you can improve your uh, words, your vocabulary. So if I noticed many of you finished reading really fast. Uh, I don't know, will somebody like to read? Will someone like to read these? Let's see, let's take two classmates okay at this point you're in intermediate five i mean this should be easy cheesy for you so come on say me and my name and your name if you want to read me jury thank you me jury someone else me and us excellent one two three go what do i need to do to become a great online marketer anyone can become an online marketer marketer but you had to create a publish content consistently then i think i am a great online marketer already just look at the post in my blog there are hundreds everybody is going to love my content Yes, everyone is going to like your content until they get to the option menu. No one likes to navigate through a 10 option menu to get the information they need, Manuel. <laughs> okay, create. Final sounds, Yuri, just that. Final create. sounds. Create. Very good. Okay, one more couple. Say me and your name. Thank you, guys. Me, Alexander. Thank you. With who? Me, Fernando. Okay, one, two, three, go. What do I need to do to become a great online marketer? Anyone can become an online marketer, but you have to create and publish content consistently. Then I think I'm a greater online marketer already. Just look at the post in my blog. There are hundreds. Everyone is going to love my content. Yes, everyone is going to like your content until they get to the option menu. No one likes to navigate through a 10 option menu, menu to get the information you need, Manuel. <laughs> okay, they need. Good. Okay, a regular teacher will tell you, okay, yeah, that's okay, great job. Let's continue. No, okay. Um, try to, just a reminder. These two guys are critical, you know, what when you we, have, uh -huh, what, do, what do I need to do? What do I need to do? Listen, what do I need to do? 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 You got it. What I need to do become, what do I need to do to become these two? Many of you are not even mentioning it. What do I need to do to become a great online marketer? Only marketer, marketer. Anyone can become an online marketer, but you have to create and publish content consistently. Then I think I'm a, I'm a great, I'm a great online marketer already. Just look at the post in my blog. There are hundreds. Everybody is going to love my content. Yes, everybody is going to like your content until they get to the options menu. No one likes to navigate through, through a 10 option menu to get the information they need, you know? Okay, number one, read the conversation again and complete the sentences below. This was easy, uh-huh. Anybody? Anybody can become an online marketer. Okay, number two. Everybody. Everybody. Everybody is going to love my content. I only have one student in this class out of 20, uh-huh. Number three. Everybody. 
Everyone. Everyone is going to like your content until they get to the Everyone. options menu. Okay, and last one. No, no one. No one. No one. Okay, no one likes to navigate through a 10 option menu to get the information, information they need to get the information, the information, the or the? The information. The information they need, perfect. Okay, and this is basically what we started earlier um, about how to use definite, I'm sorry, indefinite pronouns, indefinite pronouns. Keep an eye on that. We're talking about pronouns, indefinite pronouns. What other pronouns do you remember, by the way? No. What about me? Don't forget about me. Like Eminem said, come on, me, you, us, them, and etc. Okay, so this is just another kind of pronoun. And there is one very important pronoun that you should know by now. If you guess it, I'll give you $10 right now. Five, four, three, two, one. Buy $10. Okay. Who? Who? You remember who? I told you that before. Remember, who is another indefinite pronoun? How do you replace who with he or she, right? So it's similar to this. Now, we respect this. With who? We also respect this. You treat it as a third person. Nobody likes. Who likes? Okay. Who likes pudding here? Stefania, do you like pudding? No, I don't like it. You don't like pudding? What? Really? No. Okay. Like Chocolate pudding. It's delicious. <laughs> okay. You got it? Who likes? Okay. Who does? Who jumps? Who sings? Who stares? Who studies? Etc. Third person. Nobody likes to be bombarded with ads and pop-ups, pop-ups. Okay, can you continue? Let me see, Irene, continue please. Okay, uh, is anybody working as a community manager in your company? Okay, perfect, Irwin, next. Okay. Anyone knows about search engine optimizers nowadays? What nowadays? Okay. Any anyone knows about, about search, search engines, engine engine optimization nowadays? Nowadays, now what? Nowadays. Nowadays, nowadays. Okay. It, that sounds weird, right, guys? Anyone knows? No, right? It's like an opinion. Yeah. Anyone knows about search engine optimization nowadays? Okay, not me. Next one, uh, Judy. Somebody? Uh, somebody is, um, let me see, somebody in the company likes to read or monthly article. Or monthly article, or monthly article. That's right, be careful when you need to treat uh, one of these indefinite pronouns as a third person, Anybody know, anyone knows. No one pays attention to dual advertisement, advertising. No one pays attention to dual advertising. Okay, be, used to, be sure to use the verb that accompanies the definite pronouns, okay? Is in singular form. Be sure the verb that accompanies the indefinite pronoun, okay, is in singular form. Be careful with that. Okay, let's move on. Here, I yes. have a question. Please. If you are using everybody, the verb is in third person as well? Or? Everybody loves Raymond. Yeah, that was an old theory on the 90s. In the 90s. Everybody uh, hates Chris. Everybody hates Chris. <laughs> yes. That's true. Everybody loves okay. Raymond. Everybody hates Chris. Yeah. You got it. You got it. Everybody wants to rule the world. 
Okay. So let's do this together. Go ahead. Yes. What is the meaning of dual? Dual advertising. Dual advertisement. Somebody help. What is dual? That's a negative word. Dual. Okay. Google fell asleep. Okay. Dual advertisement is like useless. Nobody pays attention. No one pays attention to dual advertising. It's like useless. I mean, I don't need to see that. Can you correct me, Google? No one. No, no, no. Dull. 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 Let me check. Ball. This. Boring. Boring. Useless. Mm -hmm. Dull. 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 Dull advertisement. Okay. okay. No one pays attention to dull advertising. Mm, let me see if I remember any dull advertising that I have seen before. No, not at all. Actually, everything has to be colorful. You know, colors have to do a lot of marketing, a lot. Okay, let's do this together right now. Just go on your notebook. This is on page 32. If you want to do it on your student's book, exercise number five, circle the correct word. Compare your answers with your partner, with a partner. Page 32. You just need to underline the right option.
Okay, are we ready? Are you ready? Are you ready for a good time? Oh, look at that. Okay. okay. Nobody reads the magazine? What do you think, guys? Is that right? Yeah. Yes. 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 What about anybody from the office? Can mm -hmm. help you? Help. Yes. Why? Yes. Why I cannot choose helps? Because you're the saying on what about can? So, in other words, if I remove can, what happens if I remove can? Anybody from the office? Oh, I won't be able to say that right. Yeah. Yeah, it will make sense. Okay, can help you. Remember, after a model, you need a base form of a verb. Okay, number three, somebody is. Is. Somebody is trying to unlock the password to our web page. Number four, does anyone think? Think. 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 Uh huh. This is a good project. Okay. Does anyone think this is a good project? And last one. Right. Right. No one writes right. new articles. No one writes new articles for the guest post of the week. Yep. You got it right. Okay. Uh, Justin, can you move number three to a tag question? Mm. You are trying to log the password to our web page. Mm. Adding you? Yeah, that will make sense. That will make more sense, right? Can I use indefinite pronouns with the questions? Think about it. Somebody's yeah. trying to unlock the password to a web page. What will be the tag question? Houston? Isn't um, it? You should know. Cool. Now, this is an action. Somebody's trying to unlock the password to our web page. Don't they? Are they? Aren't they? Yeah, because somebody. Mm, yeah, that's when you have to think about the context. Somebody. I don't know if it is he, she, most likely is they. One person doesn't work alone on these situations. I don't know. But most part of the times, and you will see this in real life, when you don't know who is doing something, you will refer as an answer like they, you know. Okay. That happens in my job a lot, a lot of times. Um, you will you find on the notes, they said. They said this, this, and that. Okay, and that's it for today. Uh, you're supposed to mail your paragraph to the instructor, you know, create a 10 line paragraph, three ways in which social media marketing is helping businesses connect to their audiences and grow sales. Hey, great news for Salvador, right? We're gonna have more investors, most likely from Russia, from well, international investors, because things are going to change in many ways on how you can start a business here in El Salvador. They will give incentives for entrepreneurs, but that's for international entrepreneurs, not us. So I don't know, things are changing in our country, I think in a positive way. Um, tonight, I'm staying with one of you tonight. Oh no, again. Yeah, I'm staying with Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto tonight, okay? Are you lonesome tonight? Okay. Do you miss me tonight? Okay. Good guys, I'll see you tomorrow at eight o'clock. Alexander de Jesus and Jesoto. Present. <laughs> Andres Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Present. Good night. Good night. Blanca Stephanie Navarro Flores. Dora Elizabeth Flores Mendez. Present. Good night. Good night. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Present, good night. Good night. Erika Beatriz Lopez Morales. Present, good night. Good night. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present, good night. 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 Good night
Present teacher, good night. Good night, Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present, good night. Francisco Madeo Villacorta Chávez. Present. Soy Vladimir Cortés López. Good night. Glenda Laura Cerada Renderos. Present. Good night. Good night. Amos Alfredo García Granadino. Not with us tonight. Okay. Jose Alberto Salas Benítez. Present. Good night. Good night. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Present. Good night, teacher. Good night. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Good night. Good night. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. Present. Good night. Good night. Stefania Carolina Reyes Sánchez. Present. Good night. Good night. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Okay, present. Jessica Yanari Cortés Díaz. I'm here. Good night. Good night. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Good night. Good night. Roberto Luis Omaño Orellana. Suleyma Ivonne Moreno de Hernández. Present. Good night. Good night. Okay. Irene Azucena Cuellar Albanés. Present, good night. Good night. Javier Isaac Guevara Miranda. Present, good night. Good night. Thelma Clotilde Peña Martinez. I don't know. I think we lost her. Anyways, good night, Jocelyn. Good night, Andres. Good night, Roberto. What's up, man? What's up? <laughs> I was finishing the platform. Really? The platform? Yeah. The, um, yeah. Four unit. Fourth unit. Oh. Yeah, fourth unit. Yeah. Hey, are you, you are, you are working at home, aren't from you? Home. Yeah, I'm working from home. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. Yeah. You too, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah, but sometimes, you know, lately I'm, I'm getting really bored in the afternoons because I have nothing else to do. I just, well, I do have things to do, but uh, I don't know. I get like lonely, you know, during lunch. And then I have to do some home chores. And, but eventually you, you get to do things faster and then you have more time off. Yeah. And then the problem is that I don't know. Social networks are boring. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know what to do, man. Honestly, <laughs> I think I have to go to the gym, but I'm lazy. Actually. Yeah. And even my dog is becoming lazy and fat. <laughs> He's always sleeping. Yeah. And it's impressive for a hoshki to be lazy and fat is not normal. Toshki, yeah. <laughs> yeah. This guy is crazy. So what about you? What have you done? Um actually nothing. I'm the, the same, it's the same all the time. Yeah. Same same old, same old. Same one, same old, right? Every single day I have to take calls. And, In yeah. Spanish? In Spanish, yeah. Mm -hmm. oh. What service are you on? PlayStation. PlayStation in Spanish. Yeah. Really? Yeah. <laughs> so you're playing all day? No. <laughs> no? What do they do? I mean, do they contact you because they have problems connecting or what? Everything, actually, is about customer service and uh, how do you say that? Technical, technical support. support. Yeah. Regarding Both. technical support, do they have like, I mean, the PlayStation, you can connect to play online right yeah you must yeah <laughs> for it to be funny okay to entertain uh so i'm just wondering what could go wrong playing online it's just the internet connection isn't it yeah actually because some people they some people cannot Play online to ports of the of the modem are blocked or locked. What? Sometimes. Really? Yeah. I didn't yeah. know that. So if I I I have to contact my service provider and they're gonna charge me for it. 
Actually not. No? Because, no. It's actually we provide them the the number of the port that we need that they need to dial open. Yeah. And I and that's it. This is the the easier easiest. Um, the easiest process, I guess. Oh, really? Yeah. Just, you don't go, you don't just go like okay, contact your service provider, your internet service provider. I'm sorry, that's all. <laughs> Not actually, because you have to revise the their accounts. Settings. Yeah, accounts and some details about modern and some mm. test on the on the console. Mm. Or... So you, you can can you run can you run diagnostics remotely? No, but I guide guide to consumers to do it. I guide consumers to do it. I, I guide, guide consumers, consumers to... to do it. Well, actually, users I guide the users okay. to do it. Okay, players, <laughs> players. Yeah, I guide the players to do it. Is that your? What's your most common call? Everything actually, because you have. I mean. I receive calls for refund, for account recoveries, for console that need to be sent to ASC or yeah, the workshop. service. Service, yeah. And with this PS5, yeah, it's difficult because some people are so angry because it's a new, a new PS5. Yes, but uh, is it giving problems? Yeah, actually, because what? I, as far as I know, this happened when they um, launched a new a new version of the PlayStation, right? Mm -hmm. The first year they had it's like a like a test, actually. I, I don't know, but many many console need to be sent to to service that's a common yeah. issue oh my god yeah you discover a new problem you reported you report it and they and they in create an investigation about it yeah things like that <laughs> it's a big problem because you have to you have you have to reach your goals on service and yeah service uh, how do you say you have to get good service you gotta get good service you gotta get you gotta get good service really you know my um my brother-in-law sent my kids a controller to play games online but the problem is that there is no shared folder in El Salvador, it's just in the States. I think it was named Ava or something like that. It's the just, name. Yeah, the name. It's just a, a controller that you need to connect to the internet to play any game like on Google Drive, for example. Uh, yeah. I can't remember the name of that thing, but I, I haven't checked. That was like six months ago that they received that gift. I can't remember the name of it. It looks like an Xbox controller, just like an Xbox controller. It is okay. a, it is a, it's a paid service and then you have free access to all the games online just by downloading them to your, to your TV. You can play from the TV. Oh, sounds good, actually. Yeah, but there is there is not supported here, you know. Okay. So, <laughs> so, so that. <laughs> that is a big problem. Yeah, I don't remember the name. It was a joystick, actually. I can't remember the name of it. Then, do you have a PS Five? No, actually, no. Yeah, I have no PlayStation, actually. <laughs> but How do you? I'll... How do you learn about it? Actually, we have on um, our computers. Uh, it's like a virtual. How do you say? 
virtual ps5 virtual ps4 mm -hmm. and you can see all the options about it to learn or you can guide consumer consumers when you are talking with them at the same time you are review or you have the steps in the articles some articles mm -hmm. Yeah, this is sometimes I have to <laughs> to look on on my cell phone and mm -hmm. Google Chrome and some yeah because I sometimes when you need to be supported these people is the CM CME CME mm -hmm. are busy, right? And they're always busy. Yeah. But in the in, um web page playstation web page you can find a lot of troubleshoots really well of course yeah i mean some people is lazy to go there you know yeah actually we use the web page sometimes for some troubleshoot have you experienced the xbox 360 the, the kinect did you ever try it xbox yeah the, the kinect no. No, you never heard about the Kinect? No. It was good. You know how it could scan you and you could play without controls, you know. I used yeah, to like, uh -huh. like um yeah, I know what it's like to normally but it's not it's not a like PSBR virtual reality? Yeah. No, no, no. That was previous, prior to the virtual reality thing. It was just a little bar, you know, with a little camera and used to, used to read uh, you. Yeah. So then you yeah. can just move your hands or do things. It was yeah, good as well. I, I guess virtual reality is crazier. Okay, man. I'm talking to you. Practicing. Okay. <laughs> Enjoy the night. Thank you. Good night. Bye.